Hi, welcome to Viv Cooking School. My name is Jodie. Today I'm going to show you a nifty little trick to cut a mango. So here we have a Kingston mango. Um, there's slightly different shapes for different mangoes that you do get, but you'll always normally get this little line or this little ridge inside your mango. So even if you're using the R2 mangoes or the E2 mangoes, um, then you do look for that little ridge there. And then basically you're going to cut the cheek off either side of that. The Kingston mangoes have a slightly smaller seed, so keep that in mind when you're cutting it. And then you're going to cut along side down there as close to the bone as possible and then you go down the other side and you can see there we've got the perfect seed in the center there which we've got really nice and close you can just see the seed on either side and for you guys at home that do know how to scoop a mango you're probably using a tablespoon just to scoop it out like so I want to show you one step further and you're just going to use a big kitchen spoon there if you've got one and then you're going to pop that inside the mango like that run it along the skin there so you're feeling that against your palm of your hand there and then we can pop that out and we've got a nice cheek there without any markings a beautiful nice clean surface there and then you can dice that up or play that plate that up straight on a plate for a fruit platter as your heart's desired now I want to show you the other trick which is you've got your mango here and then you're going to dice it up inside the skin and you make your little dice sections like so. Make sure you don't do this in the palm of your hand because it's really easy for the knife to slip through there. And then you take your big kitchen spoon like so and you've got diced up mango already at your fingertips. Okay, enjoy your mango.